so I'm just relaxing I just finished making some brownies I took them out of the oven so now I'm waiting for them to cool off and I was thumbing through Netflix I did a search for sewing and a show came up called next in fashion I would never heard of it before so I put that on but I haven't really watched it because I was up and down you know making the brownies back and forth in the kitchen so I'm gonna have to rewind this and see what it's about but from what I gather it's a little bit like project run runway <laughs> so I think it should be interesting I don't know if you've seen it before if you have do you like it you know what do you think I have a new sewing make to share with you so I will tell you all about it coming right up so I am about to start working on Simplicity 9380 I want to make view C with the sleeves from view B I looked ahead in the pattern and I noticed that the sleeves for view B have a dart at the very top so that should be interesting I had some scrap fabric in gray I purchased this fabric here to make the dress in view C but when I realized that I had some scrap that was also like a light pastel kind of color I thought maybe the two of these colors would look cute together but I only had enough scraps for one of the tiers and I chose the lower tier and then I cut the front skirt piece out of this section here so I'm hoping that I can make layers so like I can have this mint green and then have gray in the middle and then another mint green and then a little bit of gray at the bottom because you have to cut out three pieces of the lower tier ruffle but I only had enough for one piece. So I'm going to try to gather this enough that I can make it go into the front of the dress. So anyway, long story short, I'm gonna see how this turns out. So I am attaching the final ruffle on the bottom edge. So I'm on this bottom one and when I get this all attached I'll show you what it looks like. this dress is view C with the sleeves from view B it does have the three tiers the dart in the shoulder 
and the sleeves are actually long they do kind of pull at the end of the sleeve by the wrist area I did hem the sleeve by an inch and the sleeves are still a little long so they create like a little gathered look at the end which I actually like so the other day our power went out at home and in trying to find out whether it was just our power or whether the power was out in the neighborhood we were talking to the neighbors I heard someone say that we were having a brownout and I was like brownout I've never heard of a brownout what in the world is a brownout so my love share today is the difference between a brownout and a blackout so a blackout is a complete shutdown of power that is unexpected a brownout is a partial outage partial outage that is typically planned in advance by the utility provider to avoid a blackout